Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. Buenos días a todos. ¿Cómo están? Are you ready for our good morning song? We're just going to wait. Ready? If you're ha it goes, if you're happy and you know it, so it goes, good, good morning, preschool friends. How are you? Good, good. Good morning, preschool friends. How are you? Good, good. It's time to start our day. We are here to work and play. Good morning, preschool friends. How are you? Good, good. <laughs> How is everybody? Are you good? I hope you're feeling good today. All right, let's do our Humpty Dumpty. Let's use our helper hand as the wall and our worker hand as the Humpty Dumpty. Ready? Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. Now you have the king. Now, now your helper hands the king horses all the queen's horses and all the king's men could put Humpty together again right they worked together and they lifted Humpty Dumpty back up Aww. okay so yesterday I read one gingerbread man story and like I said it's a very old story it's a folk tale it's a very old story and today I'm going to read another gingerbread man and this time the illustrations are a little different and maybe the book is a little different so you can think about the one you you watched yesterday or we read together yesterday and then you can maybe think about the one that we did are going to do today and then you can think how are they the same they both have gingerbread they both have a wolf do they have the same characters do they have the the cow and the sow the pig remember and the old lady and the old man, we're gonna have to wait and see. And at the end, the, remember what happened yesterday, what happened? The, did the fox eat him? Mm -hmm. I wonder if that happened in this story too. There are lots of different versions. I think it's similar though, let's look. Okay. Well, I can tell you that this one's already a little different because it looks like all the illustrations aren't made out of clay. These are like clay people but I see that's how they're different. The illustrations are different, but there is an old man and an old woman. Let's see. Once upon a time. Did both our stories start with once upon a time? Hmm. Once upon a time, a little old woman and a little old man lived in a little old house. They had no children. One day, the little old woman said to the little old man, let's make a gingerbread man. What a good idea, he said. So his wife went into the kitchen. She made arms and legs and a head. She made eyes and a nose and a mouth. And then she put the gingerbread man in a hot oven. Oh, but first, what did she do? She rolled out the dough, right? She's got a cat helping her in this page. Let me out, let me out, called a voice from inside the oven. Hmm, that didn't happen in our other one. When the little old woman opened the oven door, the gingerbread man jumped out. He said to the little old woman, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. So did he say those same words? I don't know if he said the same ones, but they're similar. Come back, cried the little old woman. Come back, cried the little old man. But the gingerbread man ran away laughing. <laughs> Was there a cow in our story before? Mm -hmm. The gingerbread man met a cow. Stop, said the cow. I want to eat you. In the old, in the other book, did he say, stop, I want to eat you? No, he said, stop, I want to talk to you. This cow said, stop, I want to eat you. The gingerbread man did not stop. He said, I ran away from the little old woman. I ran away from the little old man, and I'll run away from you too. The cow ran after the gingerbread man, but he was too fast and he sang as I ran, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. The gingerbread man met a horse. Stop, said the horse. I want to eat you. The gingerbread man did not stop. I ran away from the little old woman and I ran away from the little old man. I ran away from the cow and I'll run away from you too. Run, run, as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the gingerbread man. The gingerbread man ran and ran until he met a sly. There's that word again, sly. What does that mean? A sneaky, right? Sneaky and sly. What's the word for, is there a word in Spanish for sly or sneaky? Um, 
maybe like I guess good good you can use curioso or yeah probably curioso would be or mm -hmm. so in, a fox what's fox in spanish zorro oh the fox licked his lips stop he called but the gingerbread man ran faster i ran away from the old woman and i ran away from the old man i ran away from the cow and the horse and i'll run away from you too run run as fast as you can you can't catch me i'm the gingerbread man do you know what i notice on this page the words on this page are all in a line and on this page they go around the circle I don't want to eat you, said the sly fox. I want to be your friend. The gingerbread man ran faster and the fox also ran faster. At last they came to a river and the gingerbread man had to stop. I can't swim, he said to the fox. <clears throat> the fox smiled. I can swim. Hop on my strong bushy tail and I will take you across the river. So the gingerbread man got on the fox's tail. My tail is tired, said the fox. Hop on my back. Then the fox said, my back is tired, hop on my nose. When they crossed the river, the fox tossed the gingerbread man into the air. Up, up, up he went, and then down, down, down into the fox's mouth. The old woman went home, the old man went home, the cow and the horse went home, and the fat sly fox went to sleep, his stomach full of gingerbread. Now, how do you know it's just a story, right? Because look at the end, it tells you, see the cookie cutters? The old woman and the man, they're gingerbread. And there's the gingerbread and there's the cow and the horse and the fox. They're all made out of gingerbread. They told the story from the from gingerbread. That sounds fun. I wonder if you can make a gingerbread person out of your Play-Doh. Can you make a person out of your Play-Doh? That would be so fun, right? And you can also draw a picture of a gingerbread man too, right? You can draw, what would your gingerbread story look like? Would the fox end up eating him in the end? Would there be lots of gingerbread men to go around? Would the gingerbread man escape and live happily ever after? That's what would happen in my gingerbread man story. What would happen in your gingerbread man story? Maybe we can talk about it later, okay? Let's sing, see you later. See you later, see you later, when we meet again. See you soon.